Welcome back to Glen Echo Park Aquarium. My name is Lauren and today we're going to be feeding these lime seahorses next to me. So the lime seahorse is a species we can find right in the Chesapeake Bay down on the saltier side towards Virginia. These are animals that are going to eat small crustaceans and uh, mice shrimp, very tiny things that they're going to slurp up. I'm going to show you what we use to feed the seahorses. Uh, so our seahorses are trained on this target feeder right here. So it's a very weird looking apparatus. Uh, I kind of consider it like a dinner table for them. And basically it is just a signal that is lowered into the water that means this is time for you to get fed. So our seahorses recognize this yellow dinner table, if you will. Uh, they swim over to it. They latch on with their little tails right around the edges here and they await the food which will fall down into this little trough here. Uh, so our seahorses are from a company called Seahorse Savvy. Shout out to them for making the transition with these guys. Very seamless, very easy on them. Uh, all of their advice that they've given us was awesome. They basically giving us the greatest chance of success with these guys, so really appreciate all of their help. The unique thing about their company is that they were able to raise their seahorses at their facility where they trained them on frozen or dead food, uh, which is really unique because seahorses out in nature, they eat live food, any sort of uh, small invertebrates and things like that. And that's very hard to get in an aquarium setting for us here. So feeding them frozen food is really a great advantage. And uh, it was really awesome of them to train them how to do that. So shout out to them, go check them out in our link below. Uh, but yeah, now we're gonna jump into feeding these seahorses. shrimp that we just thawed and I'm going to pour it out so we can get all of that excess nutrient water out. I'm going to shut off the filter. Oh, struggling for one hand. Okay. So the filter is off and now the water is nice and still and we're gonna see if the seahorses start making moves coming over. We also have a hermit crab and a couple small grass shrimp in here to act as cleanup crew for any leftover mysis or small things that we feed our seahorses. to see more behind the scenes videos about us at Glen Echo Park Aquarium. Check us out on Instagram and follow Seahorse Savvy on social media linked below and donate on our website. Mm -hmm.